What's going on, fellow humans and resellers? It is I, James. Readoptionagency.com, 20 plus years selling on eBay. All right. Uh, again, eBay last night shut down. Between 10 o'clock p.m. my time, which is 8 California, and 7.30 this morning, I sold three items. So I've got, uh, there was 19 items that sold in the last 13 hours. All of them were the two hours before the, the shutdown and the hour after the shutdown. So that shows you the difference between what's going on with eBay. Is I'll have four and five an hour. And then to have that long of a period of time where only three items come through in nine and a half hours. And then in the seven o'clock after 7.30 p.m., between 7.30 and 8, I think I had another four items. So it was almost like it was turned back on at a certain time. So, What's up, kiddos? So it's a pain in the booty hole. Pain in the booty hole. I got a new slogan for eBay. I'm not open 24 hours anymore. <laughs> All right, let me get this shipped out, what I pulled last night on yesterday's video. And then we'll get pulling on... This morning's. So let's go. Gospel Music Workshop of America CD. Sold for $14. Headed to Zion Crossroads, Virginia. Espana. Espana de, Espana de Football. ID this hat. Sold for 7 bucks. Headed to Australia. Alright. Shirt's been in the store for a couple of years. Cabbage, cabbage Key. Vintage polo shirt. Uh, so for seven fifty, headed to Wisconsin. Hello, Kitty. All right, hat sold for ten bucks. Headed to Irvine, California. Chicago White Sox visor sold for nine dollars. Headed to Champaign, Illinois. All right, if you watched yesterday's video with the thrifting in a Porsche at the end, those two statues, I'm just gonna I'm gonna find somebody to look at them before I even try to sell them. I don't want to. If they're worth thousands of bucks, I don't want to just give them away on eBay. Um, somebody in the comments suggested, you know, eBay might not be the right place to sell them, you know, if they are worth a lot of money. So, so I'm going to do something about that and uh, not in a hurry to sell them. But I spent $60 on that haul, and you saw this. I paid $1 for it, and I sold this for $20, so... Got a third of my money back with just this item. So it's going to Juliet, Illinois. Are you ready for a media lot? Yeah. All right. We got eight items. Seven cassettes, one CD sold for. Taking advantage of my clearance. Buy two or more. Get 50% off. What? Eight items, 20 bucks. Headed to New York, New York. Key Biscayne hooded jacket. Been in the store well over two years. So for $7, headed to Montgomery, Ohio. Z Blues. As I said at the beginning of the playoffs, we're not making it past round two if we have to play Colorado. Got a lot of flack for it on Facebook. Of course, I've got happy, happy, hockey hope for my team after game two. But I knew in reality, there's no way in hell we were going to do it. Yeah, I just proved all the people who hated on me correct. <laughs> there's, there's more than one side to me. There's the reality side. Something like that's reality. Then there's the hope side, which includes things that are totally 100% out of my control, like a team winning. And then I've got to do something about it that covers everything else. So, <laughs> all right, we got... So St. Louis Blues women's shirt, new with tags, sold for $12, headed to Godfrey, Illinois. All right, Napa Racing 2008 t-shirt, sold for 10 bucks, headed to East Haven, Connecticut. All right, I'm running for office, Microsoft Office t-shirt. Picked this up last week, I think, at the Honey Hole. Sold, or I paid one buck for it. Sold it for $10, headed to Pleasantville, New Jersey. All right, we got this woman's hat here. Sold for 10 bucks, headed to Whitney, Nebraska. 
Yeah, I'm gonna show you why, for still the skeptics out there, why it makes no sense. eBay overnight, they have to be shutting down. Like we had the eight o'clock hour last night. We had the nine o'clock hour last night. Then one at 10, none at 11, two in the 12, and then one through seven, nothing. Or one, yeah, one through, one until seven. So one through six, nothing. Seven, two, then eight, it kind of opens back up. And we're in the nine o'clock hour now. So that looks like all one order, but still, that just shows you the amount of items I sell per hour and how there's always a big void in the middle of the night. So not open 24 hours a day. <laughs> Theradoptionagency.com uh, Stamps are starting to give me issues again. I just need to get through at least three or four that have to go out this morning. All right, let's see. Vern Gosden, chiseled in stone. Cassette. So for five bucks, headed to Hector, Arkansas. That was the first $5 one, wasn't it? Right, shelf 34. This one should be right here because at the Honey Ho, I got all that hard rock stuff. So I got a bunch of Van Halen and Sammy and then that David Lee Roth that I already sold. I think this was the 25 cent day. So we got Sammy Hagar 3, a lock of box from the Honey Hole. Sold for $21. Headed out to Arizona. Shelf 27. There we go. I like it when it's easy. All right. Sealed. So far, seven bucks headed to Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. All righty. To the West Wing. <laughs> we only got two items to pull over here real quick. So I shouldn't need to fire up this computer as long as I can remember. Box 15. Eleven Brothers. And I think I've already forgot which album it was. Hopefully that's the only one that looks like it. Yeah, it's got to be it. And next one's in Clear Tote 75. So I'm going to need both hands for that. All right. This is the last must, and then we'll try to get the rest out. And then I think I got two on Bonanza that sold. So let's see. The Lovin' Brothers Country Love Ballads. One of my country, uh, part of that country lot. So, so I paid either 40 cents or a dollar for this. Sold for $14, headed to Los Angeles. All right, St. Louis Cardinals hat sold for $6.50, headed up to Canada. All righty. We got... Bonanza item number one. We got Devo, Total Devo on cassette. Sold for $14, headed to the UK. All right, next up on Bonanza, RL Archery Pro Shop hat. Sold for 14 bucks, headed to uh, Roseville, California. All right, I'm going to go ahead and delete up till 10 a.m. We're at 10.01 right now. So, as you can see, we had a few more items sell within the last half hour. So yeah, at least uh, we got sales coming in pretty consistently for now, even with that big old gap. So that's good, that's good, that's good. And then we'll see what we do from 10 a.m. until we pull later. He hears it. <laughs> He's like, you ready? All right. Man, Bonanza's been a pain in the butt. For some reason, it had erased the password. <laughs> Wouldn't let me sign in, so I had to go dig up my password since I haven't signed into that site in forever. And then it won't take a Pirate Ships International, uh, Ascendia or whatever it's called, it won't take their tracking number. So I have to put it in the buyer notes and put the U.S. tracking to the station, the company that takes it overseas. So big pain in the booty hole. All right, you kids ready? I got to get to the post office. All right, thanks everybody for watching and we shall see you in the next video. Later.